are at war, ladies and gentlemen. That wasn't a threat. I, it's, it's, it's time for a story. I have lived here since a while. I'm not a social person. I smile and nod, but I've never actually spoken to these people in the neighborhood. So the gentleman that lives in the house that is to my right has been affectionately nicknamed the Boatman because he has a boat. I can tell you nothing about this man. This is a mystery, an anomaly, a jerk. I can tell you he likes to sit in his driveway and crank his bass and shake our entire house, usually between midnight and 2 a.m. I don't even want to talk about the Christmas he bought himself a drum kit. Also, if we would come home later in the evenings, we'd see his silhouette at his window peeking out of his blinds. That's not creepy at all. Since this guy has lived here, there's been this unspoken rivalry between me and the boatman. And it starts off in simple ways, like our driveways. I should draw this for you. So if his house is here and our house is here. We each have a driveway, but then these driveways are connected by this other little patch of concrete. So when we have visitors and things, they park right here. So my old roommate and I pull through this driveway to leave, which prompted Mr. Boatman to start parking his car right here where we can't get out. Meanwhile, his guests can pull through either driveway any way they want. So now it's a game. If he's not home, I'm totally going up that thing out of pure spite. If we ever have guests over, we'll hear him start his truck, loop the driveway, and then park where they won't be able to pull out. Making everyone's life difficult, right? Fast forward to early last year when quarantine was going on. This guy brought, like, a construction truck and parked it for about two months. To top it all off, not too long ago after one of our Elsa appearances, we're getting all of our gear out of the car, and we can see his silhouette at his blinds and hear him yell, STOP SLAMMING CAR DOORS! Which just made Audrey slam them louder. One of the many reasons I love her. It's him right now. So fast forward to this last weekend. Audrey and I are eating our popcorn and watching the Muppet Show, like one does, and we hear this woman screaming bloody murder. So we look out the window, and see this. What'd you do, Bo Man? I'm not gonna make false accusations or whatever. I just know that I was somehow lucky enough to poke my head out of the door just in time to see six police officers slam this man into a wall and cuff him. And the first thing that crossed my mind was, hey, quit slamming my neighbor! I wish I knew the full story. I know he was back by 9 a.m. revving his car in the driveway again. So, Boatman, if you're watching, Thank you for coming to my gripe session. Do you like stories and things like this? Should I make more videos like this? Let me know. I hope you have a great day, and I'll see you on the next video.